Hi, dear friends. Chris here. How are you all? My hair is a mess. <laughs> um, I hope you're well. So today I have three products for you from my friends from New Craft Day. Um, there's like a partial, there's a bubble round hybrid type, and there is a off canvas product. So uh, I'm really excited. Um, to uh, show you they're really cute I wanted to say um, that if you go on the new craft day site and you spend $50 you can get two free gifts um, as well as you can use a 5% you can get 5% off if you use the code new craft new craft day 05 um, and get 5% off your order so I will of course link these in the description box below breaking news I'm linking things again so you don't have to go searching around if you know you see something you like you could just click the link um, and that'll be below in my description box and also while you're down there check out my Facebook group with my dear friend Angie from Angie Diamond Painting Adventures um, we have a little Facebook group it's a nice place we try to keep the drama out and all that kind of stuff it's a small little group but come and join us please Okay, and answer the questions too, uh, that way you get approved. Okay, so let's get to it. So every kit, of course, comes with the toolkit. We have the tray, a wax, and the pen. So everything you need comes with the kit when you order. So there's that. So let's get to the first product. So this is a partial. Um, I really like the the drills on this one so that's why I got it and the you know the image is nice too I think it'll look a lot better when it's done and you'll see from the picture I show you so here we have it's a 30 by 30 um, we have a moon and I, don't, I presume you could call this the Sun um, but certainly the moon is the main part on here um, it has let's see 11 shape sizes colors all that here is the key code and let's take a look at the drill field real quick per usual all of these special shape things are really easy to read there's never any issues that i've come across with them so there we have it i'll show you what it looks like um it's supposed to look see me when it's done So this is the picture from the website. It's called Moonface. And the, as you can see, the blue moon, and then the other side is the gold and yellows, and then it, they have outside drills and everything on it. Let's get closer for you. Uh, so I thought that was really cute. I like that. Um, I don't get many of these anymore, but I um, decided I seen that, and I was like, well, you know what? This is nice. So again, a quick little one there we go oh let's look at the diamonds real quick so again up here is the name of the code of the kit so always check that to the diamond package to make sure that they match because sometimes um a rare occasion it and I've, it's happened to me that the wrong drills have come with the kit so just check okay so here we have our rhinestones, golds, and blues. And then this is a smooth round. We have gold balls. These are faceted orange AB types. We have some smooth citrines, smooth blues, some half pearls, large half pearls, and some medium ones. So, very nice. I like I like the I like these kind of um, gemstones. I like the the gold and the half pearls, and I like those smooth ones too. They re look really interesting and cool. So again, one last look before we move on to our little moon. See, you could definitely see from the picture to the one I showed you. Um, it's going to pop much more when it's drilled. OK, 
Okay. Now our second one is a 30 by 40 and it is a bubble round hybrid type thing. There's a lot of background in this, but it's a very pretty. Um, I just hope that the, as you'll see in a second, the background is all, all these bubble round type things have, um, th they do the circles. This is all dark. So I'm hoping that it does not show through too much. A lot of times, no matter what you do, you can see through. It really only matters more when you're drilling it. When it's done, when you're a foot or two away, like how you usually would look at these, um, you can't see it. But when you're right up on it, you can see the outline sometimes. I know that kind of sucks, but when you do this kind of thing, you ha it's just what it is. So there's 15 shape sizes and colors and all that gems um right there's the key code and here is our image and our um, item number and we have butterflies now this is so pretty i don't i think yeah i'm looking at the diamonds right now the background's going to be all white so let's look at the canvas up close so you could see the three different sizes you're going to have a small, a medium, and a large white in the background. Then you'll have the butterflies done in color with some special drills in there. Okay, and here is the website. See the purple and the goldish yellow orangey butterflies? Very pretty. Okay. Let's just put that there. And let's, oops, sorry, earthquake. So let's just take a real quick look at these gemstones. Oh, I should check the thing. CU084. Okay. Oh, I just ripped this apart. So, here we have our... This is a, like, faceted amber color teardrop and some marquees. always happens whenever I unroll these they always go all over the place so some purple marquees now we have three bags of the small white ones for the background actually there's four bags not my favorite honestly I did I like got this image because I love the butterflies white is my least well besides browns but we don't need to go into all that but as far as background colors i don't really like what doing whites all that much but on these special ones it's a little bit easier than in a regular kit where you know it's different this is more again when you do the bubble round hybrids it's you're placing them not in line order so this is better than that in a regular dime painting all right enough you don't care about my preferences preferences okay now we have our two medium whites and we have some large whites again some large teardrops Ooh, these are really pretty i've never had these before wow these look like hibiscus little hibiscus flowers Ooh, we got to look where to see where those go we have our rose pink roses some rhinestones again let's look at that hibiscus so that's number eight I'm actually going to just put that over there for now. Save some time. So number eight on here is an A. So it only there's only two places for them. So those little um, things will go right there in the butterfly. 
but depending on how it looks I might actually just swap them out on these for these two because those are probably where the roses are gonna go now they ma would match colors a bit better with the pr pink here with the purple butterfly and the yellow um, flower with the yellow butterflies but you know what I'm gonna look to see what it looks like those are really pretty I've never had those before okay so here we have our butterflies and oh I just meant also wanted to mention before I get to the final um, thing which is a off canvas um, so this the order was basically placed on October 18th and I got a delivery on it on October 28th so 10 days I mean how great is that right less than two way less than two weeks um, I think that's all I wanted to tell you um, so this oh I, I shouldn't take it out before I show you the box so it came in this box um, it says it's glow in the dark I don't know we'll see here's the box here the back of the box so it is a you know nice sturdy box sometimes their boxes can be um, flimsy but this is actually a more substantial box so we have our diamonds here now this does have a light feature so you put the batteries in here and you'll string the lights through with this one I probably will do that because it's a you can stand this on the table so we have a toolkit again right there and here is our project it is a Christmas project it is a train with Santa and his the toys in it um, so this is really cool I've done something similar to this before however this one is even better because the other one I did no was it no I think it was two-sided yeah the other one I did was um, it had a hanging thing with like a suction cup sticker thing this is just really to stand on the table so what you'll do is they give you two pieces so you have two pieces I don't I, the other one no the other one wasn't two-sided I don't think it was a Christmas tree it just had a plain backing of the, the the artwork of it but this you have to drill both sides and so what you'll do is you want to go on here want to go here so here you have it um, before I move on I'll just show you up close the drill field what it looks like I don't have the dimensions of this but you know it's a nice size I mean I think do I have a little yes I could give you the inch of this so it's 11 inches by 6 so 11 across and 6 from from the tallest part to the longest part it's 11 by 6 again you drill everything on this side the back sides are blank and you have, of course like I said you drill both of these and then what you'll do is they give you this here's your two kit two kit I'm not going to demonstrate this now um, but you'll have these little pegs they're these white pegs so and they also give you these clear oops these clear little screws and they give you a screwdriver so what you'll do is you will put the screw through the one side then you screw this on that side and then you'll screw it like this and so you'll see space in between here and you'll do that all around and you'll be able to stand it up on the table just like that and it'll be display and like I said there's a lighting feature so the lights there must be holes somewhere probably um, I'm not too sure 
how many pegs there are compared to lights. Or, oh, actually, no, no. Scratch that part. So you'll put... Um, I'm remembering now. So you, you'll screw put those pegs and screws through all of these holes there and then what you'll do with the light part and I'll probably wind up showing you this when it's done you'll wrap the lights around the little pegs you know and do a loop through here and then they also give you this little white thing which is kind of a sticky and that's I'm assuming because that's the only thing why it would be here is for you to tape or put the sticky on this side it's a double-sided probably so you can put that maybe on the inside of here or something um, to stick it down so you don't see the little battery pack part so um, here is the information from the website and what it looks like Sorry for the blueness. I just it doesn't work for me, but I, I still want to do that for you all because I, I don't know if it helps or whatever. But um, I just want you to see what it looks like on the website or give you some idea of it. Um, all right, so that's basically it. Those are the three items I have. I'm super excited about doing this one. I think this will probably turn out fantastic. Uh, it's another holiday theme one. I really think this is such a cute. Um, design and uh i really like i, I i'm going to put this right by me and have it displayed by me in the kitchen where i am most of the time um for the holiday season so again we have our little santa christmas train full of presents we have our hybrid bubble round butterflies and we have our crescent moon with sun however you want to interpret it okay so with that said i want to thank new craft day so much i truly truly appreciate it uh, i want to thank you all for sticking with me for your love support kindness comments likes and friendship and all that stuff um as i said before the link the facebook group and these items will be linked in the description box below and um we'll see i don't know if by the time you see this it's possible i might have tacked on um a finished product uh and if i do it it will either be the sun or the train likelihood is i will not do the canvas items anytime soon so you might see the train finished at the end of the clip if not stay tuned because this will be done soon and you will see the finish soon at some point all right again thanks guys so much thanks new craft day and until next time everybody please 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 be safe be happy stay safe stay happy bye guys okay guys i'm back real quick though I did finish the Christmas Santa train. Here he is. He's saying, come on, ride the train and ride it. Come on, ride the train and ride it. For any of you a certain age will know the no. Okay, so now this is a double-sided um, piece. All rhinestones as you can see it looks really cute I really love this one I have to say and here's the other side so as I said you have to well first see these little clear screws you have to screw that on through here and on the other side when you're done with everything with the diamond painting the things you have to screw those on and uh, then you just they give you a light pack so with this uh with that little piece of sticky tape so you just uh, stick that in there with the lights and the battery of course wherever you want and you wrap you find a, however you want to wrap the lights around the inside with the pegs and let's turn it on i'm gonna actually let me turn my light out here excuse me so we could see for full effect the lights you 
So they have different color lights, you know, some yellow, green, uh, blue, and pink. So that's what it looks like with the light. Is that that? Let's turn it back on. See so you can see. Yeah, you could still see it with that on too. So I would highly recommend this. See, it just sits. You can't see it, but believe me, it just sits right on the table. It's it's secure. You know, um, I have no problem with that, with it staying up, and it is just completely adorable. If you like Christmas decorations, you want to give it as a gift either done or undone um, minimum assembly required but it's really easy to figure out and it's really just a really adorable piece for Christmas time so there you have it thank you so much to new craft day and thank you dear viewers and friends and my true blues I really appreciate you I hope you enjoy the Santa train all right. Thanks, guys. Until next time, be safe, be happy. Stay safe, stay happy. Bye.